Hey, this is Steve with Dabble Lab, and in this tutorial, we're going to take a look at playing an MP3 file in an Alexa hosted skill using the S3 bucket that is created when you um, when you create an Alexa hosted skill. And in this, uh, doing this tutorial because this um, has come up quite a few times where uh, it's it's kind of confusing um, if if you aren't familiar with how to use the uh, the media folder in the uh, the hosted skill but uh, we created a template that hopefully will make it a little bit easier if you go to github.com slash dabble lab and then search for alexa hosted s3 audio example skill or you can go to skilltemplates.com which we uh, relaunched again with the templates available that you can launch and it's in here this it's number 35 this alexa hosted s3 audio so I'm going to start with that, and I'm going to just deploy the uh, the skill. You can click the deploy button, and this will deploy the code to your um, Alexa developer console. Pick the account, and I'm going to fast forward. This normally takes like two to three minutes. Okay, now the skill is all deployed. So if you go to next steps here, we can um, we could just link out to the developer console here. But um, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. We'll open it in the uh, the developer console. We've got to do a couple of things um, to get it going. We need first to uh, probably change the invocation name. So the the default being used here as template zero. I'm going to just change this to um, just change it to demo skill and save and build that. And while that's building, the other thing that we want to do is enable testing for uh, development and um, the, the skill that's uh, probably still building. So we'll give it a minute here. But the uh, the skill code itself in here is um, pretty straightforward the there's a couple of things that you need to do so uh, when you set up an Alexa hosted skill there is also an s3 bucket that's created and that's this link down here I'm gonna open that in a new tab and if you just go ahead and um, add a file here uh, and I'll upload a file so you can see and I've got a file that that's all formatted to work with Alexa which uh, which, by the way, is important. Um, Alexa supports uh, MP3 files, but it needs to be formatted correctly for it to work. And uh, we have another tutorial on how to format the uh, the audio. But if the if you go through this with your own audio file and it's an MP3 file and it doesn't play, chances are the uh, the audio maybe is too loud or there's something about the uh, the audio file that isn't right. Uh, Jobotech actually, Jobo.tech had uh, Jobo.tech has a um, a tool. Where is it? It's like the audio converter. This here which if you have um, an mp3 file you can just upload it here and then it will convert the file or format it the right way and then you can download it this is great for doing a handful of files if you're if you've got a lot of files um, there's you can also use a uh, ffmpeg which is a uh, uh, we cover that in, a, in another tutorial but it's a, a probably a, a faster way if you've got lots of them but anyway let's get um, let's get back over here so in this code here there is once you upload the file you just need to reference the file in here uh, if you don't reference the file we'll test you'll get an error so let's start there open a new tab for testing and it should be it should be all built now Hello world with audio. I am having trouble connecting to the audio file URI. So this uh, error message here is because we haven't set up the uh, this here. We just need 
this to reference a file that is put in your S3 bucket that was created for the Alexa hosted skill. So again, the S3 bucket is created by default um, and this media folder is created by default. But if you just try to use this URL here, it won't work because the Alexa hosted skill S3 buckets, um, the files are not public. So actually, I think if you try to view it, you'll see access denied. And so what we need to do is we need to get a signed URL for this. And that's what this code example does in here. So first we'll <clears throat> change this to my uh, file name is uh, one small step. And I'll save that. And then the, this util file is available. This is in the, the template, but this is also a file that if you use the um, Hello World, the default Hello World template, when you're creating a new Alexa hosted skill, this file is in there. And this file is a helper that provides this get S3 pre-signed URL function that um, gets basically the signed URL that we need to, to read that file or to, um, to, to use that file rather. There is one, I don't know if it's a bug or if it's just, um, I don't know what it is, but you also, like I had to do this, like replace the and in the URL that's returned with this ampersand AMP. So basically like encode this, that, that seemed to be the only character that was a problem, I guess I, I guess we could fix it in here as well and just like return it and fix it. But anyway, it's it's done in, in this part here. So what, what's happening here is we're requiring the uh, util here and then using it here on line nine to get the, uh, the audio URL, get the pre-signed URL. And then uh, I'm just using it in this response here with an SSML tag for the audio. And so we'll deploy this and test it again. So it's really simple. There's just two lines here. There's this that you have to add, and then this, well, three, I guess. And then you need to include it in your, uh, your output. So with that, you should be able to, uh, to test and try it again. Hello, world with audio. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. And that's it. I mean, it's pretty straightforward. That is using MP3 files in the S3 bucket that's created when you set up an Alexa hosted skill. Hopefully this is helpful. If you have any questions, you can leave those. Uh, in the, uh, the comments and we'll respond just as quickly as possible. If you did like this video or if it was helpful, please like it on YouTube and subscribe to the uh, Dabble Lab channel. It's youtube.com slash Dabble Lab. Thanks so much.